That's a good segue into, you know, kind of choosing a side and location. Um, you want to just talk through the, un for the uninitiated, you know, why we generally go on the rights, what, you know, what vests we're accessing. So I'm like, right, IJ, right, IJ, right, IJ, until I have to go on the left. That's how I feel about it. Um, so I really like going on the right. Uh, it's a shorter distance, like your catheter distance will be shorter um, because you're going from right, IJ to brachiocephalic to SVC. Uh, you know, it's just a longer distance to go from the left. Um, I don't know how else to explain it better for the, the trainees, but um, as you start to put in more and more catheters, I mean, I'm not saying it's a big hurdle to overcome because certainly it's like surmountable, but um, right IJ makes everything easier. Yeah, it, recently I had a case where the, uh, you know, I had a Mediport on my schedule. I go up to the lab, you know, typical day, kind of busy running around. Okay, nice Mediport. Think it's going to, you know, tip shot case. I, I come in, I got, I talked to the patient. They had already prepped the patient out because they were, they were waiting. And so I'm talking under the drape and I'm talking about, Hey, you know, what kind of cancer do you have? Oh, it's breast cancer. Okay. Where's it at? Oh, it's on the right side. Okay. You know, where on the right side? Oh, just upper you know, outer quadrant, just under, <laughs> just under my clavicle. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> right. Yeah. Right. Where I'm going to put the Mediport. And I was like, okay, well that this isn't going to work guys, you know? And so that, so after that happened and you know, this is at a lab that I'm not at very frequently, but I say, look, I got to talk to these patients before you prep them out because, or you guys have to ask, Hey, where's your cancer at? You know, what are you being, how are you being treated? I think it's very important to talk to the patient beforehand and be clear about what they're being treated for, where that treatment is. She was going to undergo a lumpectomy and radiation, you know, shortly thereafter. And so I was like, well, I'm not putting a port right in that, that area, yeah. you know? Um, and so you have to be careful about that. And of course, and then I had to go on the left. Yeah. And I think it's, it's still fine um, to go on the left, but you know, like if yeah. you're going to have, like, if you have a patient with breast cancer on the, you know, the right side, then, and you know that they're going to get radiation or mastectomy. Um, a lot of them, by the time they get to me, have already had the mastectomy. Um, and then lung cancer, like high lung cancers, like at the, um, you know, yeah. like at, in yeah, yeah. Towards the apex, uh, you know, you want to avoid there because it may end up in the radiation field. Um, and I'm trying to think of what else, like, like, it seems like lung cancer and breast cancer are the ones that routinely come up for me. Um, another reason that I like going right side, and I don't know if you have this issue or it's not, it's kind of a non-issue and it, it seems like small to complain about it, but whenever I tunnel, I'm more comfortable tunneling with my right arm. And so, yeah. Oh, yeah and, and so sure. like tunneling on the left side, you're using your left hand, which is still very doable, but you know, everything for me is just more comfortable on the right. Yeah, it's tricky. And then the other thing is, you know, what, and we're going to get into technique in a sec, but I just want to talk about limitations of left side of ports for a sec is once you get your wire down and you get that peel away sheet down, mm -hmm. some t depending on the length, sometimes it could be a little bit short, yep. right? And so when you go to put your catheter down, it might pop into the azagus, uh, right? For sure. Um, and, and then it can be really hard to get out uh, or it just doesn't quite make the length or... I even see them pop up into the the right brachiocephalic, right? Bra yeah, yeah, right brachiocephalic vein. So those are those are things that, you know, kind of are annoying about going from yeah. the left.